good day viewers and thanks for tuning in to Polymer Update TV, the world's first and the only TV network with a free petrochemicals news show. You're watching the petrochemical market synopsis with me, Indra Singh. It is Tuesday, October 5th. Let's start with energy news. Crude oil prices spiked over 2.5% on Monday as OPEC and its allies mutually agreed to gradually restore the oil output that was slashed down during the pandemic despite insistence from some countries for a larger boost in the oil output. Also, the weakening of the US dollar further supported the price rise. Brent futures surged by $1.98, settling at $81.26 per barrel, while WTI futures bolster higher by $1.74, settling at $77.62 per barrel. On Monday, open spec naphtha prices marched higher by 8 US dollars per metric ton at 726 US dollars per metric ton CFR Far East Asia levels. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to quickly tell you about the Polymer Update Academy. At Polymer Update Academy, we provide customized corporate training courses to assist you in expanding your knowledge in the petrochemical, chemical, pharma and light sectors. The tailor-made courses will be exclusive to each business with renowned professors from the field of education with over 30 years of teaching experience conducting the courses. The objective of the courses is to provide operative professional training for you and your teams to help improve business processes and or products. Back to news now. Let's take a look at feedstock news. SM prices inched higher in Asia on Monday. The price rise was prompted by stronger upstream crude rates and lift in regional buying sentiments. Before updating you on the status of plants, we wish to announce our dates to host the Global Race, Recycling and Circular Economy virtual conferences in association with SPE Global, SPE Recycling and SPE India. Race America's virtual conference is scheduled to be held on October 7 to 8, 2021. This is where the world's top recycling experts will gather to address the pain points of America's plastics recycling sector. The theme of the conference is recycled applications and their collective end use. In plant news, Zegros Petrochemicals has brought on stream its number one methanol plant on September 28, 2021, following an unplanned outage. The plant was shut on September 21, 2021, owing to a technical glitch. Located in SLUA, Iran, the number one methanol plant has a production capacity of 1.65 million metric ton per year. If you like our video, don't forget to click on the bell icon to subscribe to our free news channel and like this video by giving us a thumbs up. It motivates us to continue to bring you this free informative news service on a daily basis. Our special news in today is sponsored by Surat based Amarke Industries, one of the largest sellers of packaging film in India. MRK Industries offers a full range of packaging films from 07 to 70 microns which include BOPP films, CPP films, metallized films, PET films. That's all for today. Don't forget to watch our daily news video tomorrow to know more. This is Polymer Update with me Indra Singh from Mumbai. Many thanks for watching.